are just crazy out here. You can see by my hair, it's just whipping it all over the place. And we are just north of I, or sorry, we're on I-35, just north of Ames at a rest stop right now. You can see there's still quite a few cars on the road, but you mentioned high profile vehicles earlier. So what those are, are SUVs and especially semi trucks. We found quite a few up here going north on I-35 in the ditch. This is one we found near Ellsworth. The truck driver, David Warren tells us, that he had just dropped off a load in Des Moines and was heading back to Albert Lee, Minnesota to reload. That means his trailer was empty. So the winds were just moving him all over the place and he was fighting the wind the whole time up to that point. So he had just called into the office just before he landed into the ditch to let them know that he was gonna pull over and wait out the winds. I come into this clearing and the gust of wind just picked me up and brought me over and set me on my side. And I mean, there was no stopping it once it started. It just picked me up and threw me right over like I was a piece of trash on the side of the road. And as you can see, Mr. Warren made it out okay. And he says he's very thankful he had a seatbelt on. We also talked to a trooper out there over at, at the accident. And he said at that point, that was about a couple hours ago, he had heard about five semi rollovers. And since then we've heard about quite a few more. Live in Story County, Vanessa Payne, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader. Well,